in this video I'm going to show you how to do the new Halloweeners quest. It's a really fun quest because it is Halloween themed. So when you are in the Terra Villa you have to go all the way down. So when you are in on the new land you have to walk down again and walk to the right. Right here you will find a huge sinkhole. If you walk into here you will find yourself in a Halloween themed Terra Villa. Have a look at how this new Terra Villa looks like. On the left you see a horde of zombies, you see some ghosts, and some, some pumpkins and a lot of other stuff. So it's really fun to walk around over here. So if you want to see more please have a look. But if you want to start the quest you have to walk up and to the right. In this top right corner you will find a huge spider. When you talk to this spider you will start the quest. This spider tells you to find Sister Pamela. She is one of the goddesses. You can find her in the center of the town. So go back to the fountain again. And on the left of this fountain, on the top left, you will find Sister Pamela. When you talk to her, you can see she gives you some seeds, some grumpkin seeds, and she also told you to give it to Flavia. So Flavia is next to the uh, general store. You might know her from uh, previous quests. So let's talk to Flavia and give her some seeds. Right now she also gives you a new hint. You have to give the next seed to the eldest one. So please follow me if you don't know where the, the eldest one is. You have to go to the left of the fountain and right here on the left side of the map just below the horde of zombies. Right here you will find old man Gurney and he says yes I will take the seat but he doesn't know why but it doesn't matter because this is the next um, the next hint it is a loyal wife with red hair that's Mrs. Pembroke you can find Mrs. Pembroke on the right side of the map and a little bit down And in front of this bank, you will find Mrs. Pembroke. She also takes the seat and she gives you a new hint. The man near the flowing blood will take the next seat. So that's Officer Pete next to the fountain. And Officer Pete gives you a new hint. You have to go to a friend drunk on life. We all know that is Officer Barn Birdie. So let's go down again. Walk to the left. And in front of the drunken goose, you find Officer Barn Birdie. Talk to him. And he gives you a new hint. It's a boy standing in the shadows. This boy is called Ron. And Ron is standing in the shadows next to. Uh, Mrs. Penbrook. Right here you will find Ron. And he says you have done well mortal one. He also tells you to go back to Alma. So this guy was the last guy you had to give the seeds to. As you can see you also have six Grumpkin seeds left. This you can keep. If you go back to the fountain and then do the top right, you will find Bar Baroness Alma. If you talk to her, she gives you a few grumpkins. And there is also a tall grump o lantern I have no idea what this utility is. But as you can see, you have completed the Halloweeners quest. Here I am on my main account. I suddenly remember something Heidi had said during the AMA that this quest will take the whole weekend. As you can see, 
you cannot do anything with this seed and finishing this quest also doesn't give you a badge. So my guess is there will be a part 2 of this quest coming soon. Of course I will make a new video about it when I find out, so make sure to subscribe to my channel. In the meantime, have fun during the double XP weekend and maybe have a look at this next video.